Partly, it's a sign of respect, and we're going to follow this, this incredible caravan out to the funeral home. Shannon Sohn and Newscopter 7 also following it, and they have cleared the way. There's no question about all that traffic, Shannon. Yeah, they absolutely have cleared the way. In fact, we watched them close the Queens Midtown Tunnel and the LIE for as far as we could see, and that is what you are looking at now. In fact, we've got dozens and dozens of uh, motorcycles here doing an escort out in front of 101, and that is the ambulance that is holding the body of Officer Jonathan Diller as it makes its dignified transfer from the medical examiner's office through to the funeral home in Massapequa. Now, I'm just gonna bring this shot out a little bit just to give you some perspective on it. When we went to commercial, you saw them going over their first overpass. You see NYPD Aviation coming into the scene as a show of respect. They are following this the entire way. In fact, it's a show of respect. LaGuardia Tower is letting us hear it, which is a spot they don't normally let us through, but they are doing their best to allow us to follow this so that we can bring it, these pictures to you. One of the things that you will notice as you see this, you saw it going into commercial break. On every overpass that comes over the LIE, you are going to see members of the NYPD PD as well as fire department and EMS, and they are just there to show a sign of respect. In fact, I'm just gonna bring this camera out just to show you a little bit. Here is the next overpass that is coming up, and you can see exactly what I am talking about there. On the right side of your screen, you see all that traffic that has been diverted off of the LIE, so traffic a nightmare as you head through this area as they make the way for the body of Officer Jonathan Diller, but, but you will see that, that salute from the fire department as a show of respect and obviously you can see just how far ahead of this dignified transfer they have shut down the LIE so it is a clear path all the way to the funeral home but you've got all of the motorcycles in front and all the dignitaries behind with officer Diller's body in ambulance 101 PD aviation overhead this is one of those times when you're stuck in traffic and you don't even mind because you just want to see him being brought to his resting place as this horrible events that unfolded yesterday. Reporting live over the LIE, getting very close to the Grand Central Parkway at this point, Shannon Sohn, Channel 7, Eyewitness News. So powerful. It right? is a, a moving every single time we have seen this mm. display. Fire Department paying its respects um, outside the funeral home in Massapequa, Long Island, which is where this they are escorting the body of Jonathan Diller. Police officers also lined up there as they were lined up outside the medical examiner's office. This is a 31-year-old young man who was killed during what should have been a routine traffic stop with a child at home less than one years old. It's hard not to be moved by this solemn procession. We're going to continue to show you this procession as it unfolds as a sign of respect throughout this newscast.